the die is tied to a tropa that's you know the dies die has these other things like that are deterministic of its value which is like the the circle two then the circle two probably has a thing that goes to circle four and then four to eight eight all the way up in that way that whenever it's the it makes it it makes it way easier to control the peg and that it creates a waterfall effect because the bots only have to worry about one liquidity pool but then there's a stack of liquidity pools to where it's just not having the bots chase it they just kind of just peg it around ping it back and forth so that they can you can't flash loan die so like he's determined that they found out a way to keep die safe from being flash loaned against as well through a tropa so a tropa is, is literally controlling the uh the ability for people to not be able to harm it with the bots and with the way that it uh literally just kind of compounds upon itself with all of its all of these uh intrinsic other copies that no one has found out what you know what exactly their function is but in our opinion, their their function is to let die reach its peg and then maintain the peg and not allow it to be harmed through the use of bots and just the way that the uh, the stacking of liquidity would work. Because they would just be, they'd be you'd, they, first off, they'd be able to keep it on. They would almost be able to keep it pegged just there on their own, um, much less with a group of people assuming it's, assuming its value. Because there's just so many fucking bots. Which again, this is like millions and millions of dollars worth of bots. This is a, the the Spark Bridge is millions and millions of dollars. It's not just some put together. Like if you've ever used the Spark XYZ bridge, it's just I'm, we're talking like you can't even click your MetaMask over fast enough before your shit's over there. Basically, once it's set up, this entire chain will be anti-Mev attack on anything blue chip yeah for those, that exact reason they're, they're yeah. they, they, they feel the fact oh this is mev resistant this is mev resistance it's like pulse chain itself will be mev resistant pulse chain itself is going to be ipfs behind everything so it's like once it's up and running and the government's pissed off they can't take it down at that point it's like it's already up and running so it's like they're, they're keeping the they're keeping what they can out of the out of line of sight well single-handedly changing the face of the at least three chains which would allow the single-sided pulse pulse x staking which everyone wants like here you go you get so much more but here's single-sided staking just just yeah like why would you want single-side stake on something unless it's being used for something. Yeah, and it's, it's, that's a perfect use case. That's a perfect fucking yeah. use case. It's the fact that if you're not on that chain, but you, you need to provide liquidity to the meta bridge, just provide liquidity to the meta bridge, and you can do it single sidedly, yeah. and then they'll be the same. They'll have the same opportunity on that side to provide their liquidity single sidedly. And then it's like, all right. Back on the Welcome to decentralized you know, financing. And then you, and then you literally have the you have to really connect right to Binance. You've got to, you've got the centralized exchange without having to worry about, you know, having to run one yourself. And then the only the only thing that would be missing at that point is literally a bridge to BTC, and that means right, that means the pulse wrap BTC would have to find fair value before that happened, which would happen overnight pretty much because the uh, the centralized exchanges would start selling for die for die because the die is a dollar. And that would uh, ramp up liquidity within weeks. Yeah, that's, uh, yeah, I know it's a lot, Sam. That's what we've been talking about, though. No, I appreciate it, though. Appreciate it. Yeah, hundred percent. That's uh, that's it. If you have any more questions, man, feel free to ask, dude. Uh, hundred percent. I'm we're... dropping now and then. I just uh, really enjoy all the. EM4 in here. Yeah, man, I absolutely do. That's uh definitely love uh, telling people what we're got going on. We know we know that's kind of crazy at times, but we've been pretty close to on the pulse of what's been happening up till this point. So, Greg, I think if you say that what you just said on the AMA tomorrow, bro, it's gonna go crazy. Bro, I know, dude. I can't, but you know how everything like the timing has always worked. Like the timing of me me finding out shit has just been like ample. Like right on point. Yeah. The one thing though, I've been, I've been I'm getting used thinking to about though, like you kind of just what? touched on it. Like I don't know. 
I don't know if it's like a great idea to like bring a lot of attention to this, to be honest. I guess what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I don't know either. I just, yeah. I would, because, I would have to fill uh, the crowd out. We need to bring. We should leave out it. Yeah. Because if it's too viral, like, Correct. I don't know. Yeah, it needs to balance the. This might be too fucking data. Like, this might be too fucking. Because you say it goes crazy, right? And and people just buy the shit out of it. I mean, do you think they're already and built to essentially happen. run it, like run it? Like, yeah, I don't. I think, yeah, I think I really do. I think the fact the fact that we saw the bots over there and then him unwrapping all this is, liquidity but is that really on ETH and then essentially doing the money same. stacked up in the fishing contracts. I mean, yeah, that's that, remember, that's yes, cool. yes, deep liquidity, huge deep liquidity pockets. Yeah, because I think I think these For probably a, got a, a fail safe, right? If shit hits the fan, like yes, he, and, he, and he has the, he has the same thing on BNB too, though. He has the same he was doing the same thing on BNB, bro. Like I didn't even know that. Like he's got the same fail safe over there. Why would he have it on, on all three? It'd Wait, be the, the perfect the fucking setup contract? for this type of. Yes, dude, the same thing yeah. on BNB, bro. Like so, that. it's the perfect fucking setup for for a for a combination try like a try bridge, try chain meta privacy chain because the way that the, the bridges work they're private you can literally fucking ha- work across them and have it sent to a different address so at that point you would literally have the first and only evm privacy chain that's just so, right I there mean, in front of everyone if we can verify and you i assume did this through his wallets that yeah. those those are those, those fake phishing were set up by him and there's value real value yeah. in them and they're acting as if that there's nothing in it on, on three yeah. different chains yeah. like Bro, yes, dude, that's that's, that's, some, that's some crazy shit right there. My head hurts. My head was hurting the other night whenever I found out about it because I didn't, I couldn't. Well, what the fuck was damn. On. Let's think about it. Like we were originally thinking, oh, maybe that was all written off, so that when we, when Richard did do the big liquidity pull, that the chains would not register that type of whale bridging oh, yeah. activity. Yeah. Now okay. we're flipping the script and saying. That value is there so that the chains can be utilized to uh, yeah, but maintain it would, it would that value. Try, but it'd be a tri chain thing. Like at that point, the value would not go to the chain itself. It'd be going to the tri chain. It would be like its own little yeah. independent privacy, private liquidity chain that'd be sitting, that'd be sitting on, you know, on a layer above where the, you know, that's where they unlock it and say, okay, start following it now. But it all goes to yeah. those routers. One plus one that, plus one equals one on this one. Son of a bitch, and then all the die that, like all, all that die that we, we believe is not a dollar. Like everyone else believes it's a dollar. No one else is going to know the, the difference. Whenever you know, whenever they have to re up and start selling, you know, getting new people on board on the Binance, they're just going to be buying it and selling it for a dollar. And like overnight, that thing's going to be a dollar. It's like it explains a lot of his silence. It also explains, you know, getting the SD to pay to like watch exactly what I'm doing and how I'm doing it. I'm about to be fucking. You know, he knows he is about to unlock and unwrap some of the biggest shit that ever happened. I mean, Maker, why would Maker Dow be giving up a billion dollar protocol, handing it over to someone just with knowing that, you know, why are they making a, 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 a chain that's literally going to mint stable coins, that's wrapped versions of stable coins, with a, a hybrid and a proof of stake, proof of work, unless they were going to be doing something. The only, the only on. way you do that is if you know the money's there and he's got the money. Exactly. You, you there's no way Rune's gonna tell be like, no, fuck you, Richard. What are you talking about? And then you know, he's like shows the makers what was, what was makers valuation? I mean they're billions. billions. billions, billions. Right. Yeah, three yeah. billion. They're not gonna three, three, three. They're just handing I mean, over they're, they're they're handing over something that's making them build like and they they became the like it took them this long to be profitable and it took Spark to do that. And the fact that Richard bought fucking four million dollars worth of Spark and is literally using it that's what, what, what and then using the copy coin to flash loan some of these fucking pools out like that's some of the stuff we can't see but it just makes sense for him to take take snapshots of these pools and to flash loan them out to at least to do some testing to make sure that this can't happen to die and the fact that he's got a tropa and then all these copies with the bots working it makes it to where die can't be flash loaned against so he's like he's back testing and beta testing these these exact same things that Oh my god, I don't know. Fuck me, dude. Atropa I just want to clarify. Bl- so you think Atropa is essentially a... It's protecting Dai. 
it's it's a, it's a med resistant bot resistant way to where die cannot be uh die cannot be manipulated by flash loans because it, you, you know it has the circle two then the circle two has another rash another ratio another pair that goes up above it and then that contract another one that goes up above it basically is a quote unquote another stable coin because all the other liquidity yeah. pools are going to be it's it's basically a, an inception play <laughs> yep it's huge it's absolutely huge and it, and it makes it to where these bots don't have to run around chasing the price the bots just the bots don't have to all the way come back down here and then chase it back up and all the way down you just have to have a bot two bots working on that the very top two bots working below it two bots working below it below it below it and it creates this waterfall effect where they, they're able to ping and peg die right to a dollar like and they can and if, them, and if they tried to flash loan it they would literally just peg it the other way and the flash loan would not be a wouldn't wouldn't take place because the bots would would wouldn't see the value in it. They wouldn't see the being able to make money off the flash loan. So they would just peg it wherever it needed to go, back and forth, front running right, the other pot. Let me ask you this, this this nomia that we've all been waiting for on a tropa. What what do you think that particular utility may essentially support here? I mean it's 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 supposed to be a layer two, right? Is that Yeah, well yeah so that would be based on an actual framework. Have you guys seen that? Like there is a game. Oh my god! I forgot there. about that. Yeah, yeah. That that, yeah, that I think that, that might be a whole other fucking use. That might be that literally might be the decentralized mechanic, like that it's keeps Warcraft things off chain. Yes. On fucking so like yeah. steroids to the like hundredth power. It's so it's like, like a decentralized mechanic to where it's for onboarding and just you know utility. I guess I would have to think about it a little bit more, but I'm sure it's going to be some sort of on chain, but uh, you know on and off chain type of uh it's very DAO, similar to like what DAO. you're coming up with rig like i i wouldn't be surprised if james doesn't message you at some point and, and say hey bro you build this nomia the game <laughs> this is crazy dude well that's, I know that's that what someone's i'm saying been listening I mean, to what we're doing. the l2 is essentially going to be an, a DAO. another it's be a DAO. layer to essentially yes have Protect another, another tropa on a third on the third dimension Yes, and to, also to, 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 get yeah, everybody into the fucking system. Yeah, like, so basically, you, in a way you, then you have an understand. L3, an L4, L5. I mean, it's you know what I mean. Just... Technically, yeah, technically at that point, it'd be because you look at you look at if you look at pulse as an L L2 because it kind of is a copy. And then you look at a trope, the trope that we see is an L3. That would be an L4, and then it's off chain too. So you got on and off chain L4, L5, and then it's still running its own you know system to where it's protecting die. Yeah, and, and, the, bridge, and, and the bridge copies can be paired to each other, and then do the, yes, yeah, it's just a fucking like. I mean, it's, 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 it's yeah, it's adding it's adding a whole other layer. To, it's adding a fourth dimension to the uh, to the three dimensional the the, the 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 triangle that we know of the three chains that we know of. It's adding a fourth a fourth and a fifth because you have Spark that's going to be running all the uh, running the the bridging and things like that. The Oracle services, you know, uh, it might be playing a role within that whole realm of being able just to close all the, 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 the loops and bringing everything to a figurehead and everything to like a reality, so to speak, of, you know, an on and off chain reality. Damn, I forgot, I fucking forgot about that. I was like, I don't even know what you're talking about until you're like, oh yeah. No, no, so I know we know that when Maker The question is, does he, does he know this? Does, does, <sighs> he has to, there's no other way. Yeah, no, he knows. He, he, he has knows. to know. He, he oh, has yeah, to know. Yeah, he know. It's been talked oh, about a fair amount, and um, and a lot of people have been digging on that. And um, <clears throat> I don't think he has the complete picture in mind, but he already knows right. enough to know that it's like. Hey, and that guy's going to peg it. Yeah, and, that, and he's definitely, he's literally changing the world 100%. And he's literally the way that he's built that system to protect die like that is fucking so massive that people still can't wrap their heads around a tropa. And it's like, but no, that's it. That is it. It's the fact that it's the ratio all the way up to one coin, all the way back down. The bots that run up and down it to protect it. The bot, you know, right now it's not at a dollar, but when it when it reaches a certain price, those bots are literally gonna be able to just peg it and keep it at its peg because of the way that it's ratioed all the way up and down, and it will keep it from being attacked. Which was, which is usually what gets them be pegged is, is attacks and something attacking it, you know. I like got whether it be a flash loan or another type of uh, whale coming in and just dumping the price. Like they will not be able to fucking yeah hurt it. 
and like I think so. A lot of the fun about Atropa early on was it seemed like a lot of the coins were being created. No, they for, are for yeah. just out of thin air. Yeah, well, yeah, they he was just fucking yeah, exactly. They, 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 they won't even know. Yeah, yeah. Oh, so we only know that there's, 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 there's an there. underlying purpose for those, or do you think? Yeah, that's the underlying purpose. They were, and they were just like things he tried out, and they just didn't work out. I think he said that sort of along those lines. No, I, no, I think I think every single one of them has a purpose because every single one of them is ratio to the other one. So even it, so, if if something if happens to happen to a, like Teddy, same Damn, he's going in and out on some on some alpha right now. I fucking hate when that happens, bro. Like that, like that's the I'm low point of my day when that shit happens. There's been an audit going on. Yeah. And when I get what each token is, and yeah, there is a purpose for every single one, and they've been explaining it. You've been reading the logs. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that was yeah. So like it's, 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 yeah, it's, it's like his vision. Working. Right. But you. But you. No, I think uh, they all served a purpose. Because the way James said it, and it was, someone asked them the question, and they were like, you know, you would create this token, and then, you know, you would, like, the MV, you started fucking minting on it, and then, and now, stupid, stupid shit like that. And people... Yeah, so MV, MV, MV is a gas token, so MV, MV equals the gas times a thousand. So, yeah, so the that MV one is will a bad example. Because um, that one actually... Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, there's a lot more. There, there is a lot there's more, you're right, there is a lot more. Just, they flopped, it seemed like, basically. And right, but they but, but they might not think. serve a purpose until they might not serve a purpose until like die hits its hits its value. Um, right, and then, the then the liquidity like, would fall correct. down. Boom! Me. Yes, and then it's it's like a perfect it's a perfect waterfall trap to just make sure that it's and and even, and even all the way back in even all the way down to the leprosy tokens that are just like the forever down tokens. Like even those are going to serve a certain a certain purpose of reality, and like you need. To have money that gets trapped and falls into these into these crevices and into these cracks to create these floors of ever ever increasing floors, so um, you still need that there because it it actually it's kind of what happens in society, right? There's money that goes into drug dealing and goes into a crackhead's house and you know God knows where it goes. It just kind of gets spun around in a circle, but it never reaches, never comes back. So like you need like for for uh, actual reality of money, which is what he was trying to create, right? Was uh, TSFI that you know that that means this monetary theory that he was coming up with is like literally the trap like. Money traveling through the system as if it would through a through an actual fucking society. When the bots are, then the bot the bots don't know how to act like a drug addict, but the bots know to trade that pair. So since the bots don't know, don't know how to act like a drug addict or a or a fucking entrepreneur that's gonna take their money through teddy bear, like if they don't know, they need a bot that's gonna strand off every now and then and act like a fucking de- degenerate because they can't teach a bot to be degenerate. So they, this is the best way to do it: have it trade like a degenerate. And just you know, technically lose the value by creating this ever increasing floor of because if you, it's pretty much it's, it's burning money without burning it, right? It's actually put it's actually putting burnt value to existence. Holy shit! Yeah, it's literally taking money that would otherwise be burnt, right? And uh, you're literally giving it a purpose because it's protecting die itself and protecting the value. So you but you're not having to burn it. Well, yeah, theoretically, like burn, a way to access burnt so LP. Yeah, exactly. Yes. Got seventeen percent of the of the supply burnt. So God damn, dude! And the more that he has, the more the more dies protected. So, so like so whenever it, so, so whenever it hits a dollar, it'll stay at a dollar. Like it's not it's not like we thought. Like it's gonna go to a dollar and then back down to seventy cents and shit. Like this thing's gonna go to a dollar and more than likely fucking stay there. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's once I was, once it hits the cent there. point, it's sent. There is no turning back. Swing traders get fucked. I mean, there may. I wonder. Okay, so the I will, I'll, I'll devil, devil's advocate here is right, if there is that much sell pressure, right? And there's not enough. Right. I mean, could it's going to flow around your smaller right. tokens yet? Then there yeah. could be some fluctuation until those fill up. You know what I'm saying? Right. If there's I, not agree, enough, I agree. Because seventeen percent is is a lot, but is it is it enough for what kind of sell pressure are we talking about? Yeah, that's really exactly what I was going to try and say. Is like. Based on the past performance, like you have to, you know, base that on what where we're at in the cycle, and that's why so many people are so fucking bearish. And it's like, well, tell me, show me the fucking winners. Like, are you do you are you do you understand where we're at? Like where we're at in the cycle. Like, like you know what I mean. Like people are basing it off of like 
the shit of the shit bear and then saying, oh, I can't do this. And it's like, but they'd have no fucking vision. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah they're definitely not. They, they're definitely um, not looking, looking for the, yeah, they're, they're, they're looking at their well, bags. I'm not. Yeah. Let's look at cell pressure, bag. though. If you've got a tri chain bridge setup designed to essentially protect dye, Wrapping upon wrapping upon wrapping liquidity, it's all about damage absorption, right? Even if you were to sell 10% of your die across a bridge to a different chain, that chain is still backing up the main chain with liquidity anyway. The three-way Oracle system will not allow the value to drop because the other two will change everything around. It would it would self arb across it across each other to balance it all out in one hit. Yeah, because you're not dumping it at that point. You're not selling it across chain. You're literally the oracles are just going to pick it up you're on the other end. You're simply moving it. Yeah. Yeah, that's. You're moving your accessibility to it. What the point. fuck? Like, it's because I know and I know that like wild I look into Spark. And like Sparks, their, their whole their whole bridge service looks like something that's going to be like out of this world, and it makes sense that it has to be out of this world because it has to be like those Oracle services that said that are they work as this like this island. It's what is what it looks like to me is like this Spark is this little island that just kind of connects everything together with Oracles and bridges, and also protects Dai. So whenever the next the, whenever the the other chain comes out and Dai is minted and wrapped, and the Oracles are keeping the price up, and then whenever it's moving around these three chains, it's just it's able to keep its value and it's able to be tracked. You know, the way that they've kept USDT out of the equation, they've kept USDT like just literally off to the side. They know we don't want no fractionalized liquidity, you know, involved with this. So I mean, here's the- here's the selling point, right? If 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 all of this is true and, and somebody that is not a, a die believer now and we wanted to get them on board. If we oh said God, that right, no. if we said that right there, right, they would it would be more of an investment shit. prop, right? Because if you know it basically factually, if we know if it's gonna hit a dollar, but it might fluctuate yes. for a little bit because depending on the liquidity situation of the other pairs, you know, backing die. Correct. Just um, time, just time at that which, point. Which right. would usually be fiat collateral, but in this case we're using liquidity from another token yes. that has from a from web of liquidity kind of stabilizing that token essentially. So it's basically yeah. uh, it's it's your one two right in the pulse trend. See, yeah, yeah, see, and uh, Trofa might actually whenever they go out there and they make their layer two, they're gonna have their own bridges, right? So they're gonna be they're gonna be able to throw their own Atropas over over to those two bridges yeah. to help. Well, I think the other thing is, is that oh shit, Atropa. I, I think this Nomia is an L L two because there's gonna be more projects get built. And and for their own yeah, utility, yeah, right? Because because yep, Atropa has so Trump much fund. liquidity, it just makes sense to go that direct. Yeah, right. So I agree. I think there's gonna. I, I think maybe that's really what they're waiting on before they do all of this. Um, they want more liquidity, at least on the pulse chain side. Again, maybe the uh, what Secret said. There'd be not enough backing on other chains that the R if if pulse chain went too low. Would, you know, will we be good? So maybe it's not needed, but if it was needed, then it would make sense that we would be waiting for Dysnomia to launch, get more liquidity on new tokens, because I think people are are done with the Atropa tokens. They're not going into those deep LPs as much anymore, um, or that, that path right. that has too far anymore, because um, right. it's just got so much. So an L2 would make sense, because it would sort of re-energize the that exact same play. Yeah, you're able to Again. you're able you're able, to, you're, able to, you're able to fractionalize that liquidity in a way to where it, it starts protecting itself and then building it building upon that liquidity in a in a way that just be, makes it more decentralized and in effect. So it's right, not so it like just the so it's would be a token or you know basically whatever would, token that has the most liquidity would bond to Atropa and now you've got essentially a decentralized what Atropa, Atropa. Is to die. Yes, exactly. So you literally have a backing to for, to Atropa that you literally have yes, 100% Right, so <laughs> I, I'm wondering if that L2 is 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 what we're actually waiting for. If we don't actually need that, that's that would be my question. I don't think it's necessarily needed. I don't think. I don't think. I don't think any other chains will be 
enough. I, enough, I, yeah. I, I think so. I think even I think Richard even thought that too. I don't even know if a triple was even necessarily his a, a thing until it until you start thinking about it, like how big it is and how important it fucking it, it can be and is and how much it probably is needed. Um, and then yeah, after that, I mean, maybe it's just something that's just grown in and that and grown into what it's become because of just the manifestation of fucking his his vision because it's exactly what was needed. And then being able to take that L2 as a, as a whole other layer of being able to protect the tropa, which is protecting Dai. So it's like, which you, Dai would be, you know. Liquidity onion layering. They literally took Tor and added it to money. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Holy but yeah, I don't, uh, not thinking about it, I don't know if it would be needed. I just think it would help Amplify, stabilize yeah. the die fluctuation more so. I agree. The L2 I agree. Set. But I agree. I, at that I, point, I don't think it matters. I mean, I think the cat's out of the bag. And yeah, I cannot believe as soon as you, as soon as you, you know, as soon as you brought that up, I was just like, wait, this is exactly what a trouble was meant for. <laughs> like, it's with the ratios all the way up to the bottom, all the way up to the top, the bots pegging back and forth, whatever. Yes, Q bot that brought that up earlier. It's like this waterfall effect that protects die from being flash loan. And it keeps it to where it can actually remain at a value that, you know, that the people assume that the value is. Yeah, I, I'm just wondering, like, does anybody actually know on here what dysnomia is, like, in, in detail? Like, that is one area of the Atropo system I have not. So it's like, it's, yeah, it's, it's a, like the, the game itself, you can literally spend your entire lifetime playing, right? So you travel around this world and you can literally spend your entire lifetime going around and collecting, collecting goods and services. And uh, it gives the utility to tokens that would be playing inside this game. Like if you ever played World of Warcraft, it's like, so it's it's, it's, it's like you said, it's World so of Warcraft the, on the steroids. video that we saw basically is what's what that yeah. is building that. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's so, like literally a text based, a text based style based, which almost seems like a DAO, right? But they give it a game feel, which gives it a gives it the opportunity to move on chain to off chain, on chain off chain reality utility to these other tokens, which then centrally you know, keep make a decentralized off-chain utility for a tropa itself and real world value for a tropa itself. And now on this, top of, and this is from James is the one that described it as this working this way? No, I just know that dysnomia, that's the way the game works because I've read about it. Okay. But so we're yeah, basing this off of a game. No, but it's not been talked about it's been talked about in the IRC quite a bit. And um and out and outside, but within um, some of the OGs, some of the people, and some of the whales that, that I are, don't even think you know they know what we know. Like, I, I mean, there might be a there's there's definitely a, a feel for like it's yeah it's there to protect die, but I don't think they realize maybe we all don't realize how quickly this could happen. Well, I, I'm only asking because I, I'm just curious what the utility or what is the, exactly the utility is going to be to incentivize it's people marketing. to go down there it is part of the marketing yeah, like are you aware of what what james has said about marketing and hiring artists and like the connection with k-pop oh, i didn't know and, that yeah, yeah no oh the, yeah i remember the k-pop connection yeah i remember that yeah i mean no, it makes they, sense to attract yeah, there's a lot more market i mean if that's what the purpose of that was yeah i think james is um a very well-rounded and wide band you know individual who also can you know be hyper like um focused on right. on, on on the tiny you know i cannot believe of, like the, the way that this is all falling together it's fucking absolutely incredible that was like wow So yeah, uh, there's some things like that that guy, um, some of the tokens Richard Hart. I directly... have a way to make a stable coin in which nobody has ever seen before. I mean it That's all makes sense to me. And if and if this yeah, is no. not what he's doing, then we should probably fucking do it. <laughs> there's some really like we haven't even touched the surface of, of how fucking off the wall James is like some of the things that he's like, some of the token addresses are not uh, oh, addresses, so he, but like I he, think he, names, like if you Google them, they lead you oh, directly to YouTube videos. Like, uh, oh, I mean, that, that are, yeah, I, I need to, Zach. And, uh, you know you, what, honestly, you, you think this is sort of a, 
basically what Richard's saying right now with all these tweets, how like the blockchain yes. can have videos and this and that. Yes. That yeah, oh my god. Like Holy shit. Yes, dude. Because yeah, hundred percent. Like being able to put NFTs into into addresses to where like literally yes. whenever you put that, like that'll be like playing a music video. Like that 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 token will literally have that music video tied to it on the blockchain. I mean, that can be. I mean, that's complete speculation, but that just, just came to my mind. No, well, bro. Yeah. Like, I'm similar. telling you, like, the more I learn, the more I feel like a fucking infant. Like, um, I mean it. Like, James is doing shit that nobody's ever seen before. Like, combining addresses uh, with YouTube videos. Like, I I can't even remember how but to there's explain like, it. Like, Maybe there's like such a crazy reason for it. Like. It's like it might seem crazy and it might seem like marketing, but at the end of the day, it's like there's like this random utility aspect to it as well. Not not just the marketing aspect, but the actual utility behind it because it brings this on chain, off chain um, dynamic. Right, because to you, the can, chain. you can start to connect things uh, and connect people through network, uh, you know, adoption oh, and Metcalf's law. Like, having, your, having your own fucking. Uh, your own personal like YouTube stuff literally tied to the blockchain. That's it right there, guys. Remember we were talking about this last night. Like being, literally it's being able to run your, your YouTube. That, it it's is though. Well, that's a it's like drawing people in that don't even know they're being drawn in. They didn't sudden... even realize it. Exactly. Jesus Christ. And that's what this I'm is like date state level social engineering. But yeah, but they're doing it in a way that's like totally white hat and totally needed before someone else comes in and does it for us in yeah. a way that it's not, it's not fucking decentralized and it's not, it's not white hat, it's government. And it's, and that's whenever Richard's always tweeting about this and we're just like, oh, some people are just kind of blowing it off. Like, oh, well, you're not worried about my bag. So why would I care about that? But it's just like so much bigger than that. Like, you know, if he gets fucked, we're all fucked. And if he's able to build this bridge underneath the, underneath the fucking guys of the uh, SEC right down his, breathing down his neck, like... What can they do then other than either come on board and support what we're doing? Or they can't take it down. You got IPFS or IFPS, whatever the fuck it is. Oh, yeah, back yeah I mean, I, everybody's been freaking out about this SEC thing today. And I'm like, this is literally what Pulse Chain was built for. Like, this is exactly. like, I, people just need to open their eyes and, like, like understand that maybe it's here, maybe it's a DeFi, but it's not. Right. And maybe they just, yeah, the, the, their faith in Richard Hart went down. Put because... that on a billboard. Pulse chain. Welcome to DeFi. <laughs> exactly. No shit. Because we were talking Man. About, uh, a couple of days ago about um, how Hex, Pulse, Hex, and Pulse were all targeting the same lawsuit, but yes. like Hex might, Hex might actually go down, but it. I mean, that's why there's a copy on Pulse Chain. So did it really go down? There like, was a point. Who gives yeah, yeah. Like, was, over there? Well, there, there, yeah, there was a point for it, though. It's like there might have been sacrifice, but it was sacrifice for the greater good. And then at the end of the day, yeah, if it does go down, I think they're going to get a, they're going to get a whole another fucking copy on uh like, yeah, on the new chain the they dropped over there. You get that, your copy here, you get your copy there. I mean, yeah, I mean, if, if people get like, sour, I mean, there's probably he's probably thought about that too. I mean, he's thought about fucking exactly things, like. Dude, I cannot. What? I'll be right back. Damn, we're uncovering some shit. That's crazy. I need to get Zach. <clears throat> I need to get Zach in here because Zach is. Uh, he's the one. <clears throat> I remember it. I was on a, a voice chat with a bunch of. Uh, <laughs> the quote, yeah, quote, I think he stopped indeed. doing it to move to Thailand, bro. It's the time difference, I think. It kind of fucked him over. Well, yeah, that and, like, I mean, a lot of people are sour right now. It's, it's like a new level of, like, uh, sour pulsicans instead of, like, sour hexicans. Now there's a bunch of people. Now there's a bunch of sour pulsicans because, like, it just happened today in, in, you know, a major group that I'm involved with, like, there's a bunch of shit people involved in crypto. We all got to remember that. Like as much as like, there's a bunch of people that are really working hard to like make this a reality, like, and, and understand, I believe it's going to be, it is the reality and it's just going to get greater and greater. So it's really unfortunate for me to see like people get washed out by assholes, but like you can't, you know, you gotta, you gotta keep moving on. But, um, or watched it happen today, like, you know, a bunch of our, our stuff drained and, you know, people are getting sour and, 
and uh, it was just a few people that did it. But like, if you've been around long enough, you know that that kind of thing's going to happen, and like, you really got to just turn it around and see it as a silver lining, as an opportunity. You know, like, there's been many instances just in the last couple of weeks of devs of the actual dev rugging and the community taking over and turning the project into something good. So um, I think uh, Zach, unfortunately, right now is kind of stuck in a little bit of that situation where he's been yeah. kind of... Um, I mean, we can pick it up over for him, though. That's the thing. I mean, that's what I'm trying to do. I mean, not really. I'm, I'm trying to get these AMAs back up again because I feel like the information we have right now is insane. And I, the fact that there's not 100 people in here right now doesn't make any sense to me. So that, that tells me people yeah, don't know Yeah, and I shared this. They don't I know about it. It is, it is very but, complicated dude, for the normal dude, person. But it, People are busy as fuck right now. I mean, if you saw some of the numbers that some of these projects did the last couple of days, people are on the fucking edge of their seats right now. You know what I mean? Yeah, All across the board. Like, they're, they're you know, like... I'm not even looking at charts right now because I got so much shit to do. Like this, I'm, you guys are my entertainment right now while I'm actually working. You know what I mean? That's why I'm just cutting yeah, in exactly. here and there. Like, and I haven't, like, I, I don't even care. Like, I know we're going to blow the fuck up. Like, I think Q said it before, no, uh, or Codex, they're like, I'm already happy with my bags. Like, I already know, you know, where we're going. Um, but a lot, most people are not. Most people are trying to pump their bags right now, and most of them are getting fucking wrecked. You know what I mean? Like, um, that's the sad part. But the sad part of those those people, like, they're literally getting out of a chain that is literally about to. That but I guess possibly... that's what I'm saying, though. It's that if, if you understood what we just how much bigger they talked is. about in the last thirty minutes, they would realize that this narrative, not even narrative, this eventuality, will help their tokens. 100 x so why would you correct fud or not be involved Part of. it just doesn't make any sense it's counterintuitive in my opinion right it's it's a problem with the mentality of how the operation how um the how the ecosystem has been up until now it's like well, no. I mean, we we we've been, we've been a part we've of seen... We were on the BSC. We we were a part of the BSC guys, so we saw a bunch of this shit happen. We've been a part of this kind of shit, so we already knew what was going to happen on Pulse Chain, right? Like there was going to be shit like this kind of shit. These kind of devs, these kind of people, this kind of alternate reality. Like a lot of those hexagons that just kind of got a, a part of that type of reality for the first time. Like they're not used to that that uh that type of uh level of treatment. But you know, coming from the BSC, like I was expecting it. Um, it's just unfortunate. Well, honestly. A lot of people are losing their shit right now. They're losing their houses. They're losing their cars. Oh, I know. Losing, like, you know what I mean? Like, I got friends. I got friends that were like that were right here with me a year ago that have no money left, right? And yeah. it's just a, it, and like it's uh, damn straight. Like the, 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 their bags, are, yeah. their bags are ones that I've sent them of die and stuff. You know that that are just going to sit there until something happens. They probably they they don't, they're not checking it. They don't even know if they have it. You know, um, so it's just kind of like. Yeah, it's rough to know that they're they're gone for now, but it's just like, well, well, you know, which come, goes exactly back to them. Pulse Chain OG's comment. Like, it it really does blow my mind that like there aren't a thousand people in this voice chat right now. Like, yeah, that was me, and I was about to say the same thing, right? Because no, because well, he just record. He knows because he recorded this, and if he records this and he puts this out, it's gonna blow the fuck up. That's why he needs to know. Absolutely. I mean, I, we I believe to a, like a consensus though, because we got AMAs and the shit. Like, I I don't want to get somebody in a bind. Okay, you know okay, okay. Let's step back to to ground zero then. Like, what do we agree on? Like, what and what is like the actual I mean, like message? My, 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 like the 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 message is we it, know we don't what's know gonna we don't know for sure. We, well, Ground okay, zero we don't is, know. like Pulse Chain is bullish as hell. Okay, and 100%. it's so much more than just a tropa. It's it's 100%. even more than just Richard Hart, right? We can agree 100%. on that, right? Yep. So, like, we know there's he, bounties out for for and we know that he can't say anything. We know that he can't say anything. Yeah, 
totally. He can't but like, he, so like, we know he put his neck on the line. We know that he's got a shit ton of money, whatever you want to, however much you want to call it. But like, and we know he's about, you know, freedom of speech, freedom of movement, freedom to transact. You know, so we, we know that. Out. Like, so regardless of like the intricacies, which we're all trying to figure out together, the more eyes, the better, the more people getting in now, the better, like, but they, they definitely need to manage their own risk tolerance. Like, I don't have anything. Here's another another question though. Say we release this narrative, but say that Richard Hart is actually waiting for this SEC case to be over before going forward with all of this stuff. Because I don't know if, if that SEC stuff is really... He wouldn't I mean, be playing with $400 million garbage, dollars so. unless, unless he knew what was going on. And if his lawyers were, were worried or if they were too worried, he would not be buying $400 million worth of something and throwing it around with bags that are known are known his with his known wallets. Right, because well, like said, if, if anybody like us right actually worked for the SEC and they knew anything <laughs> and they knew how we figured out, what would they do? I mean, I, I don't know. I, I, think I mean, the closest person we could ask that money. question of and get a straight answer would be code. Because code's the closest debatable. thing we've got to um, a person who's been inside the institution and would understand uh, what's right. required. None of us know why Richard's doing what he's doing 100%. But, like, if you step back and look at what we need to do as as a whole, like, this is what we have to do whether we win or not. In my mind, yeah, exactly. you know what I mean. Like, and and it, it is what Richard needs to do because he's got he's got so much money tied up in all these different places. This is almost it probably and him for him to do this it makes sense, and then for it to be done for him it makes even more sense for well, everyone else. Because well, he's, hold he's, on, hold on, hold on. So, I think now let's think about this a different way. The this is, is a technic technically the way he's pegging die is a new form of stable coin. So yes. you could, if I was the SEC, I would use that angle to say, well, this is new technology, bullshit, whatever. And they can come at us from that angle. Well, no, 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 because it's not about pegging guys. It's about how Dai reaches a dollar. Dai reaches a dollar th- through social consensus. There's no, there's no it becoming or doing anything out of the norm. It started at zero. It's just like, and it's just because people believe that it was exactly. worth that value. It reached that value. That is it. That is absolutely it. The high level calls are from him asking us to dig. The low level calls would be from him asking us to disseminate what we find. That's what's going on. And then, and then. The community, the community. No, 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 he's helping, he's helping, he's helping them. He's helping them, I think. And by my, my opinion, that, that that he wouldn't have been over there doing that unless he was, it, and it, and if and if he wasn't involved, like he needs to be paying attention. And if he's not paying attention, like it's if it's already there and connected, it's the it, I mean, he could block, I guess to an extent. To I mean, block it, but wouldn't this? It would benefit him and his community, especially all the all the DJ, you know, all the DJs that aren't trading there now would give them a whole new opportunity. For, for resurgence and in, in crypto in general, I just don't see. I don't see why he would. Uh, so, uh, I think. I think he could hold him himself a Boston Tea Party, but at the end of the day, if he doesn't allow this to happen, all Rich is going to do is just move the infrastructure across to another suitable chain and establish the triangle that way. It may take a bit longer, but that's probably what would happen if he went and. Uh, said, no, we will not kiss the pinky ring. Well, I was just bringing the SEC up specifically because, Rig, you said it earlier that a lot of his movements are so, they're trying to be just so discreet about it, the bounty, about the. But no, but see, but they're being discreet, but like, like, they're being discreet. The answer's in plain sight. The absolute answer to their questions is in plain sight through MakerDAO and Spark's endgame protocols. Basically, it has to be community consensus that sends this to the dollar. Once it's at the dollar, that is when the infrastructure flips the switch and we become the official die. Mm. Fuck. Fuck. I also look at it like <clears throat> the, the big exchanges, the big players, CZ oh and... God. They're going to make so much money off of that. Just... 
they have to understand like what's going on. I mean, they they are employing some of the you know the the best of the best, and they and they definitely know how to work this, leverage it, whether they're working with Richard or not. And yeah. if they really yeah. understand, which I think they do, what's going on, they're going to benefit like yeah. extraordinarily. Like Absolutely. Richard was. He probably yeah. came to them and showed them. Showed, I mean, like they would not agree to this without seeing numbers and seeing things going down. They wouldn't even allow him to touch those wallets that he had deep, deep, deep pockets of liquidity sitting in the other day. With, I mean, if they, if they, they would have shut it down right then and there if they thought that it was some kind of malicious or any kind of, you know, they, they, they had to have known Whales that he was going, are going, going to do that. Yeah, whales are opportunists. Like, you know, if they're they're going to take advantage, we know that. You know what I mean? Yeah. And like. That this is an opportunity for all of them based just on how it's built. You know what I mean? Like yeah, the single side liquidity that the, uh, from the, the, the privacy part of it, just the, the onboarding, the, uh, the tactics, the, the infrastructure, the, the shit. Yeah. And the, the same thing thought. goes with, yeah. Like look at Trump, look at Cuban, look at, you know, like, there's there's so many instances of, of of crypto being used, and it's been get they kept as a whole for a long time on purpose. You know, like we know this. And there's a big swing, and there's like and like the, the the quietness of the crowd and the uncertainty of the crowd, and then you know. Right. The, I think they're just they're, suing everyone to hold everything up. I said the same so thing either. So they're, just, they're throwing it out so that they fucking Wall Street can get their end, bro. That's and what that's that's what, really, yeah, hundred percent, totally. And see, and, and Richard knows that if he gets this up and running, like, think, yeah, they can have their ETFs, they can have their centralized control over their their little things, but there's always going to be this this decentralized mechanic that is is untouchable, and that will be die. And if they want to come buy it, all cool. want, come buy it they dollar. all fucking come. want that. <laughs> yeah, come they buy it. All come are buy begging it. for it. They just don't want to be involved because they have their own little shit crony capitalists, you know, brothers and sisters that they have to take care of. Like, yeah. they all want this. <laughs> Damn. And bro, the fact that it's being built right in front of you. Yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. At this point, it's not going to be that. It's going to be in fuck. I'll sell my soul. I'm just kidding. Um, wow. I mean... I think that yeah, I mean the the like a trope of what what its actual main purpose serves, like the greater good of this like of die and then the the I mean the L two that they're building the on off chain utility the uh, the usability of, of of that and within itself you know people actually being involved with blockchain they don't even realize they're involved with it, um, just the uh, and that's just the uh, that's just half of it not even half of it that's like one one tenth of what has actually gone on like. DAO giving, I mean, Maker DAO literally giving up their name, their right, their their lending protocol worth billions to to become a the minting press of, of DAI, of a wrapped version of DAI. You know, you know that there's 22 billion in existence that they want to reach 100 billion within, within the next three years. It makes perfect fucking sense how they could do that and how quickly that could actually happen. Um, yeah. If this is if, if this is the narrative, then it, then of course it's going to happen. So you, I, I mean, okay. So I guess my question: you, you, you're of the perspective that all the infrastructure is already built. Basically, yes. all we're waiting for now is for a social consensus to get died to a dollar with with Correct. some help from a trouble. Yep. Because I mean, the bridge. Have you ever used the Spark Swap bridge and see how fast it is? So I think that there there might be a little bit more testing that needs to be going on, like as far as like the the bridging and the oracles on the bridges and things like that. But if the infrastructure is already built because it's already written in the end game, but the end game doesn't talk about the, the ultimate end game. It just talks about them having their own wrath versions of DAI, wrath versions of USDC that mint at, at a deterministic mining value using a hybrid chain and, and, and uh, working with this other layer one that is a permissionless L1 that they do not announce um, that Spark will be able to choose these L1s on demand uh, that... Um, is kind of connecting and how like how spark swap is going to be working on building front ends for for s die and maker like so they're going to be building these front ends on right. different so, chains I mean, ba and then basically the reason why i asked you that is that if if this is happening and i believe it is then we believe that everything's set 
and Correct. therefore there's no reason to gatekeep this information. Uh, that's what I'm getting at. No. I mean, I, 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 I mean, the, there, you know, when I saw the, whenever we saw the bots on Binance, I'll have to double check those wallets and double check those bots. But I mean, I saw them trading something over there it was just, just like the same deep liquidity that we saw on uh, on ETH, right? That was like a look a scan, whatever the fuck. Da, 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 there's no money here, but you know, it doesn't show the value there, but the value does exist. Same thing, right? Yeah. So it's like the, it's like what else would you use that for? It's like you would use that for a deep liquidity pocket, that for a new type of uh, a new type of layering of these chains to where and and then Spark Swap bridging that allows you to literally do private privacy uh, swaps. Because um, because in my mind, there's only two avenues that lead to this getting out too early is bad is infrastructure is not in place or right. some legal a- aspect that I just can't, I'm not. I don't think of. that they, they wouldn't they wouldn't he would have never bought four hundred million dollars worth of SDI if the infrastructure wasn't in place then. I think, in my opinion, well, like that yeah, right I mean, there, maybe that, that was the sign to earn yield. I mean, I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh yeah, yeah, well yeah, but but I mean, it, it, to me, it was mean. It was to me whenever he did that, it was the it was the proof that him and MakerDAO were indeed all in on this together from the start. That the something that I had always been assuming, but I did not know until he threw his four hundred million dollars, yeah, all, all four hundred million dollars into it. So that's not uh, something that 100%. would stop me from doing anything. Agreed. They, that's what I'm saying. Agreed. Yeah. So, yeah. So I mean, I I have no problem. I don't see a problem with getting the info out. I think it deserves it, 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 it deserves a listen. I mean, we do. I mean, we we only know what we know, right? And without it getting out, we can't either confirm or deny. We you know what we could, what 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 other people might think. And I know that there's a there's a few other people within the, the hex community that have, are speaking about the exact same thing. His name's Corey something. Um, Corey but he Tosta. literally the same, no no uh, older guy. What's other than Am? He's an older Gary. gentleman. Corey Gary G E A. Yeah, it's, 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 yeah, yeah, that's it. It's like Corey. It's Corey makes something, some yeah, juicy, something like that. Oh, that's a different guy then. Interesting. Yeah, he's a hexagon. He's a hexagon pulsagon, older dude. But I definitely saw him two or three days ago. It might have been a. I saw him two or three days ago, but it might have been a month ago. Whenever he was talking about this EVM privacy bridge that uh, e, that you know that it really could be going on because like he's has in there. He's to be a fucking movement. Like yeah, it's, it's not more just of us not, that you know, like, like we know what the fuck's going on. We are gonna, you know, we're not gonna kowtow to. If he said, to it, bullshit, if he, if he like, said it, if he said it, he's outside the community and and he's a well-respected individual. I know that he streams all the time, so why couldn't we get it out too? But I think we we're, we're touching on way more than just that 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 tri chain. Like we're touching on what the you know the utility of a trope is, the the die, uh, the DAO, the uh, the maker DAO spark just kind of putting it all together and on how that infrastructure would actually work um and he might have actually talked about it more maybe i just caught a short or something but he definitely says you know evm privacy bridge which in my opinion you know hello that's the main the main point Oh yeah. Nah. Hell no. Oh my god. That's what they want. I mean, that's what they well, that, that, that's what this community deserves. That's what this community deserves. That they they deserve the, they deserve to know what we what we think we know at the very least. Are, That is true, bro. Yeah, if we and lay that, all this out in the space. And that was fuck it. These people will be mind blown. Oh, you know that. I'm telling you guys, <clears throat> the people that we are worried about already know what the fuck's going on. Like, and yeah, no, <clears throat> we're not going to hurt Richard so by putting this information out. Like. Richard, all these I plans agree. are so far ahead of us. Like he's yeah. begging us yep. to to uncover it and understand it. Like yep. I've seen this so yep. many times just in the last month. I agree. Like just in the last day, Hotelnomics is like 
Seriously, you guys all know a tropa and you know what I'm trying to do and none of you are looking at my wallets? Like, really? Like, these people want us to see what they're doing, but they don't want to just put it out there for everybody to front run Correct. and capitalize on. They want the people that are really committed, really involved to see it, it and then yep. spread the word. Like, and Riggs very honest about what he knows and what he doesn't and what, you know, what he's 100%. uncovering in terms of information. You know, he's like, okay, this is what I'm saying. Come on, let's get together. They're like, dude, you know, Rig and Polster, they're on point. They're on to something over there. Like, because they all know, they just know that they can't say it because they, you know, they're going to be either ostracized or, you know, we already know what's going to happen to some of them, you know, or they're preparing That's exactly for it. why so many people aren't talking because they're scared of getting oh, ostracized. Yeah. And like, that is what we have. And, and, to that's just why, fucking... and, that, and that's why, yeah, that's why they reached out to me going, man, just say it, just fucking get it out there. I don't give a fuck, bro. <laughs> Let's fucking go. Yeah. Bro, you know what, you know what's going to happen? What's going to happen is we're going to peg to a dollar and then they ain't going to say shit. So exactly, who cares, bro? What they said right now? At that, yeah, at that point, it's just it's game, it's game over. I mean, all we're trying to do is get show people that the opportunity is is still here. It's always been here. It's never left. You know, you weren't abandoned. You know, nothing. Everything was done for a proper proper reason at the proper timing. The fifty two week shakeout is cut is like literally a month away. And he's literally probably going to end up fucking pegging it at the fucking fifty two week mark. And just, I mean, at that well, point, like. If we take a step back and look at it, like in what Pulse Chain needs, we all know we need a stable coin. And like, so what yeah. is the best possible narrative for it? Like, you know, that's P die. I mean, like it really yeah. is like no strings attached, you know. I mean, that turns uh, into the biggest utility of, of decentralized finance that, that we could possibly think of. Yep. Becoming, yep. becoming the most decentralized stable coin and most well regarded, per, like literally. No flash loans against it. Most well protected, given up and handed over to a completely new community to help, uh, like be, be the be the sellers of Dai. Why they go off and to their new chain and become the mentors of Dai, and, you know, through a hybrid. So, it, here's my question for you: What what do you think Richard is waiting for? The, the fifty-two week shakeout. Yeah, the actual flow of liquidity in the pulse chain, and then, which and then, we yeah, all know for, is coming. For us, for us to get it to a dollar, and the reason, the only way we get it to a dollar is through social consensus, and that's by getting people on board. Well, and, I don't, I don't know about that because I thought that be was more. the whole point of the, um, uh, what's it called, where you can swap an asset um, that has value to burn die. Oh yeah, right? yeah, yeah. You yeah, can, yeah. can bring down the, the at any time, right? Yeah. So like, you don't really need. That he has enough money in all his fishing. Wallets exactly, you're correct. All yeah, those fishing contracts good. to peg die tomorrow. But yeah, but the way he, he wants that money to stay there, so it's not he, he could. Uh, yeah, but uh, if everybody just watches, what the fuck is happening? I mean, correct. People would. Uh, I don't know. No, 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 no. It's too early. Most people are just gonna fucking extract right now. It's way. It's not time. Most people are extracting. Like we're watching it left and right. Bro, I mean, because they don't know what's going charts? on. Are you watching Pulse Chain? What's uh, what's TVL for Pulse Chain right now? Oh, uh, like six, like five. Well, in my opinion, it's twenty. It's twenty-two billion. In my opinion. <laughs> well, that's what I'm getting at. I mean, it's the amount of money on chain. Like, let them leave. Even if fifty percent. But, but, but like he always says, he always says, "Hey, shake them out, shake them out for cheap. Shake them out now, it's cheap because they're going to be coming back later and buying higher. And at this, and at this, at this point, they're going to be coming back at a hundred x." higher like valuation of pulse chain right uh, and, like, I mean, if any sane person understands what's going on you're an idiot for selling i mean they're gonna people are gonna right. sell because they're gonna take profit but yeah i don't i don't I, think it's gonna be a mass dump because no nah, bro at that point. or why are you like i meant it are you watching pulse chain there is right. shit popping off going up hundreds of percent in a day there's, yeah, yeah, because dumping, there's people that know and then there's people that don't know you're right there's people that know the people that don't know too so yeah there's definitely extractions going on, but that's, yeah, just the, either level of degeneracy or just the, you know, lack of the unknown or just that's just how it works, right? Right. So you, you think that he's probably, he's probably waiting for a benchmark once PDI hits some number. 
that's a bad consensus. I don't think it's a benchmark at all. Like I, I think it's just overall market liquidity. Like we have not yet really seen. Um, yeah, but again, am I, I just all be ready? Am I just uh, all be ready? And he's just, he's just, he's just like maybe there is no waiting period. Maybe it's just like when it's time to go, it's time to go, and you'll know, and we will all torn, know. Torn, there's, there's like, Ray, correct me if I'm wrong, but we're talking well above five billion dollars. Yeah, but I think it's around eight, 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 eight billion because it was, it was the same amount of money yeah. pretty much that he, that he took a snapshot of. Or uh, whenever you right. put the eight billion dollars worth of hex in the uh, so their contract, I don't think that the I don't that market flow. I don't. Are you saying that you you think there needs to be more market flow, more liquidity on chain to back this whole process? Well, all the all the all well, of, yeah, because because you I need would, it for um, the maybe. I want to retra- retrace what I just said. Like, yeah, there is a benchmark. I'm sure he has numbers that he's looking at, but I, I don't think it's okay. a benchmark. I don't think it's like a number. I think it's like a larger, a larger. Feels like it picture. feels like the right time, like kind of. Yeah, I think. I think. Yeah, I think. And I think. Yeah, once he knows that everyone's understanding what's going on, without him having to go out and just like say it, I think that that is that that's got to be a, a, a sign of it too. Like the. Just a level of hypeness and a level of excitement of things that could be happening and that things that you know that have been uncovered by the community are being built or being built by the community that uh that seem to be happening yeah. on Pulse Game. We've seen huge increases in some projects lately that are actually really solid projects and they're just getting sold right back down. Like people are scared still. Like um we're, you know, <laughs> there's a fear and greed index for like the overall. And then there's a fear and greed index for like each chain. Correct. And yes. the, fear and yes. Yes. the market equilibrium. Yeah, market equilibrium on each. Yeah, each individual chain has its own little uh, little rides of hides, rides of quickness. And yeah, especially whenever you don't have a lot of liquidity, those 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 quick rides and then falls and rises and falls. Those those cycles that you see, they happen quicker and quicker. And, you know, with lower liquidity um, chains. Yeah, we're only at five hundred and ten million right now. Like, yeah, that, I mean, nothing. that's that's a lot of money, but it's really not. Like, not we're talking for, for the potential yeah. of the whole chain. What we like, know, yeah, because te- technically you have to at least put us down for twenty-two billion, um, <laughs> which is insane. But well, again, it, it doesn't have to be twenty-two billion. Not not with nope. the I know. the I, I, I believe I believe I believe five. Yeah, I believe five billion. If it, it, it believe five billion would be what would be needed on on chain. I believe that the liquidity on both Binance and and Ethereum is clearly high enough for them to sustain anything. And if we needed any type of backing, I'm sure that some of their whales would gladly come to to the host of the privacy, the host of all the privacy stuff, and uh, be be willing to you know come over and uh, help these things maintain and reach consensus. Yeah, it's not a question of if. For me, it's just when, it is, I mean, the trope is going to end up being well, sold yeah. everywhere, and trope is going to be fucking just something that blows that's blowing my mind right now. Just thinking about the that, that it's what its utility is with all those bots and the way that they layered everything up the way that he did, and just in a way to where you cannot flash loan die. And the, the only reason any any stable protocol ever goes down or ever gets in trouble is just mainly due to flash loans. Um, and just you know, irresponsible or you know, someone trying to attack it because they, you know, this is a way that they've secured Dai in a way to where it's it's being held in a in a decentralized in, in, a, in a decentralized mechanic, but also through this this layering aspect and this bot waterfall aspect that these, these bots can front run other bots. So there's no flash learning that can be that can take place against it. There's no no one no big whale could come in and try to pump or dump it. Things like that. So it's like we've we've, we've taken die, enhanced it, empowered it, as the, as uh, as Spark would say, because Spark Sparks empowered it and the, the way with S die and the you know using it that way. Now that like that the whole front end of it, like the whole like being able to utilize it out out there, and then the protection of die is also now secured. And we've all done it underneath the, the guise of there are all these different entities yeah. that have seen you know, been working you know, together the whole time. Um, I would be surprised that. Once all this is unveiled, that the people that follow the models of Atropa, like Sonny's project, I wouldn't be surprised if he, if if Atropa bonds with that shit, and almost like an L three, you know what I'm saying? It's the same 